Each week, Education Matters spotlights individuals demonstrating exceptional leadership in education in North Carolina based on nominations from you, our viewers. This week, we spotlight Russell Holloman, principal of Franklinton High School in Franklinton, North Carolina. We were a school of only around four or 500 just about 10 years ago, and now we are at 1,100 and growing by 60 to 70 students a year. The Wake Forest and North Raleigh is kind of growing our direction. And so as people move here, you know, they're definitely looking for additional honors and AP offerings, um, also what kinds of hands-on technical education programs we can offer, college preparatory programs, making sure that we are you know, meeting all of those needs so that when students come here and apply to an Ivy League school or Chapel Hill NC State, or go to Vance Granville Community College or the workforce, they are equally prepared. They used to come to school, high school and just to kind of work towards a diploma. Now we really see that that change, especially in the last decade, has shifted towards you know, really a, a focused preparatory program, whether it's work focus, career technical education focus, college focus. The learning has changed. It used to be a much more sit and get type of learning environment where you had the talking head in front of the classroom and then their job was to basically disseminate knowledge and you took notes and then you studied and you took a test and that proved if you understood something. Now learning is much more interactive. We have classes in our career and technical education department, pharmacy tech, culinary arts, ag mechanics, advanced manufacturing. Our kids either are going out to provide some service, or we actually have local community partners who are coming in. There's a company called Searcy in Youngsville, which does a lot of forensic technology and equipment. Um, you know, they've come to our school and actually partnered with our forensic science class to actually do labs for fingerprint analysis. Even though we're changing, even though we're growing, um, we want to maintain that community connection and that community feel. Here's a fun fact about this week's leader. He started off as a North Carolina teaching fellow. If you know someone who deserves to be recognized, visit our website, ncforum.org, click on Education Matters, and you'll find a link to nominate someone in your community. After the break, this week's final word. <laughs> 